Meta, another emotional eviction. When did you make the decision to kind of go around and tell everybody, can I go home tonight? Well, it was a really great show, by the way. Thanks CBS and Big Brother for having me. I'm very grateful for the opportunity. Uh, when I first got sequestered and got into the house, it was tough. You know, I didn't think I'd be able to deal with it. And uh, luckily I had the support of the housemates and we were dependent on each other, but it was grinding. People see the competitions and the communication. It was very difficult. At the same time, it was very fun. Every single emotion I've experienced in the house, you know? We saw a lot of it. What did yeah. it mean to you that it was unanimous? They all said, okay, we'll send you home. Well, they could have kept me, but what I did was I put myself in position to win because in the beginning, everybody thought I couldn't win, I couldn't play. So I started to make people turn on each other. I gave Ari that one victory so I can get her two allies immediately. And that brought me about two more with Ross and, 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 uh, and Marissa. So I started to put myself in position to win. Um, whereas before, I was just having a good time and I didn't have no alliance, you know, because I figured if I make an alliance too early, they could always backstab me, you know? So I, I was in pretty good position, but it was a pressure cooker. Okay. Now, both Shannon and Keisha told me that they wanted you to win. <laughs> so you're gonna disappoint those I know, two I'm ladies. I'm sorry, I love them. Well, Shannon and Keisha, I'm so happy they decided not to get rid of me early because I, I was a little bit, I was a little bit stressed in the big house. You know, the big brother house is, is not a, the competition and then the games, everything was tough. And they kept me. So I was actually going after those two because <laughs> <laughs> I took it personal. And then I was going after James. Um, but you know, those are my sisters. I love them so much. And um, I'm glad they you know, was rooting for me. There was only one week left though. Less than a week. Why couldn't you stick it out for one more week? You know, I could have stuck it out. I had my allies, you know, I was, I made really good relationships. Uh, I know James and Mark, they had some things going on. I was in really good position, but uh, it was so hard. You know, the, uh, the big brother house is not easy. Next year I want to see, see it again and see the new celebrities, hopefully. Um, I would do it again, I'll be prepared, but I was not prepared for this. It was so hard and, you know, um, after a while, I told Russ, I'm gonna put you in position to win. Um, the same thing with, uh, the same thing with uh, Ariadna. And I think they're in really good position. If they, can keep, if, they can, if they can hold strong, they can get rid of Mark and James. And then the next one probably will be Ross to go. Um, but I want to see the one, I would like to see the women win. Okay, yeah. I like this. I would like to see the women win. Now you made it out of the house with your, your buddy yes. here, the owl. Came in handy. <laughs> Came in handy, you don't understand. This was like your saving grace in that house. It was, it was. You know, it was all, you had only so many things in the house to do. And when you're home at the Big Brother house, missing your family, I had no one to hold. And thinking about my wife, you know, my family. And when I, when I started to touch the owl and then I slept with the owl the first night, I was able to cuddle with it. It reminds me of Maya. Like, uh. So this guy, owl got me through a lot of days. And, and then you saw me walking around with it in the house because, you know, the house is, it was a stressful you know, house because everybody's trying to win and they're talking game all day. So it wasn't a joke. I didn't plan this, you know. Pop TV, thank you. <laughs> this owl came in handy. Where's this owl gonna go live? Um, you know, I think um, I'm not big on keeping a lot of things, but it was a great experience. And I think um, I'll bring it home. All right. <laughs> you get to go home now. What's the first thing you're gonna do? First thing I'm gonna do is call my children on the way to see my children. Um, and then I'm gonna call my wife.